it's Mrs. G. Welcome back to Mrs. G's Sewing Space. I'm glad that you're still hanging around, that you're learning things from the videos. I keep getting awesome comments telling me that you guys are learning stuff, which is awesome. So I'm glad my videos are helping you guys out. Um, I don't have anything major going on. I wasn't able to put my vlog out yesterday because I had taken my son back to Atlanta to get cast for a new pair of legs. So that's always exciting. He's going to be getting new legs. Yay! Which means he's going to be gaining a couple of inches which will probably put him at my height and that's kind of annoying considering you know he's built like a small planet anyways and he can tackle me to the ground and give me doogies I hope he doesn't get any ideas though but um I am waiting for school to start I have a lot of stuff to do on Monday that is not crafting but that should clear up the rest of the week for me to actually finally put out quality videos again uh, at a regular basis and on time to be able to get you guys, um, teach you guys things. So always put comments down below about what the type of stuff that you want to learn so that, um, I can figure out how to get it to you. I've had a couple of comments and so I've, I always keep that stuff in the back of my mind. I had a purse comment. I had something called a peg bag. If anybody knows what a peg bag is, let me know. Cause I'm thinking it's a clothespin bag, like when you hang your laundry up outside on the on the the laundry line, and it's the little bag that holds all your clothespins in it. Is that the same thing as a peg bag? I just need to know before I start producing something, and it's not what the person wanted. Um, I am working on the costumes. I haven't started on the costumes yet. I'm still in the planning stages, trying to figure out what materials I need. And there's a particular material called Warbla, W-O-R-B-L-A. It's a thermoplastic. A lot of cos sorry, a lot of cosplayers use it um, in making their costumes. And so I'm interested in using this, but I'm gonna have to order it online. It's not something I can find local. And I am working on. I got my mojo back. Yay, mojo! Sewing mojo is always awesome. I am working on a dress, and you can see it here, partially laid out on my cutting table, my sewing table, and it's the black Volkswagen fabric, so it's black and has little white Volkswagens on it, and I'm turning it into a, a shirt dress, and it's going to have pockets. I have pockets cut out. Where are they at? There they are. They're right there. Pockets. They're right They're underneath the the shells with the, uh, right, right, right there. Those are my pockets and my sleeves. So anyways, I'm working on that. I'm like, unfortunately, I haven't had time lately with all the getting ready for school and orientations and going to Atlanta and everything else. But I'm super excited about getting this going. I can't wait to show you guys. Yay, a new dress. That's always exciting. With pockets. Woo, even better. So anyways, this is going to be short and sweet. I just wanted to let you guys know that things are still progressing. I'm going to have a new zippy bag video out on Monday. It's going to be super simple. Well, I think it's super simple. It might be a little more difficult because it's a different way of attaching a zipper to the bag. And I think it's pretty cool. Here, I've got a... Where did, where did it go? I've got the... Um, hold on. I've got to find it now so I can show you guys. Because I had I had two made. Ah, here we go. Here we go. So, let me show you guys. So, okay. So, it's a new zippy bag. But check this out. Uh, can you see it? The way the zipper is put in on the inside is not the same. So it gives you cleaner corners and it gives you a more squared corner. So like, you know, your zipper doesn't go all the way to you know, the end. And I really like that. Let's see if I can get that to focus like that, which could also be used for, I use this as my pencil bag now. This is a marine vinyl. You see how the corners here. Let's see if we can focus. It's much better. A little cleaner. There you go. Wait a minute. Is that focusing? No. Still focusing on me. But anyways, it's a lot cleaner. But it's just a different way to attach the zipper. Now, I didn't cut my edges very well because I got a little scraggle right there. But I'm not worried about it. It's full of pencils. Yay! It's a marine vinyl. Possible school something or another or makeup or whatever. Anyways, so I'm going to show you how to do a new zipper for that. And that's coming out on Monday. And I just need to film it and edit it now. Haha. -ha. And it's only Saturday. But it'll get done. It'll come out on Monday. I promise. Anyways, so that's all I have going on now. And I can't think of anything else. Leave some comments below. Always, always. I appreciate it. Love you guys. Subscribe, like, 
throw comments down below. I love to let it get... Blah, 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 blah. There I go again. Tongue twisting. I always love getting comments and I'll always respond as best as I can. Um, if you have any ideas of what you want to see in the future, let me know. I still have my list. and I'm just going to start merging into clothing soon. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do next. But anyways, I'm going to start merging into clothing. And I still have those three patterns. See those three patterns right, 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 right there. I talked about them in one of my earlier blogs. Um, I'm still going to be doing those too. So they're, they're still on the list to do and they're going to be coming out soon. And I think that's it. I hope you guys have an awesome Saturday. And for those of you guys who are in school, I hope you guys are doing well already. I can't wait for school to start. I'll have so much more time on my hands to do things, to be creative, to volunteer. I volunteer at our local elementary school to be able to do that and to be able to take care of adult stuff, which kind of stinks, but things you have to do to survive, you know what I mean? And and just be crafty and creative. And I still have... Oh, one thing I do, I am going to do, I'm going to go up on a, all right, bleh, my mind is rolling faster than my tongue. I am going to post it on my sewing channel, but I'm not sure how you guys feel about it. I'm actually going to make it for a friend since I dabble in resin. I'm going to make a really super simple resin video, but it's probably not going to be till like the end of September just because resin is messy and it's a chemical and I need to make sure I have a cleared space for it to be able to, um, film it properly and I think that's it okay I gotta go I've got things to do adulting stuff errands to run you know what I mean I got laundry to switch I need to go do that too okay I'll talk to you guys later have a good weekend everybody bye